What's going on, everybody here, and welcome back to some more Terra Nil. So today we've got access to the rest of the maps, and that is just what we're gonna do. We're gonna start with the abandoned quarry and go from there. So hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, like, subscribe, all the fun things. So my plan for Terra Nil is I want to run through all of the maps on the standard mode, and then we want to go through back back through and beat them on environmental engineer. So. We got plenty of Terra Nil content coming up. Don't you even worry. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead. Let's check out the abandoned quarry. I'm super excited. Hopefully you all have a wonderful day. I'm having a fantastic day. And uh, yeah, just, such, you know, it's a good day today. So if you guys are having a good day, leave a like on the video. If you're not having a good day, maybe subscribe as well. That might make your day a little bit better. It might not, but it might. <laughs> all right. So we kind of know what we're doing here. So abandoned quarry. Oh, okay. So, oh, so it's all downhill from here. All right, so let's do this. Let's actually do this. I kind of want to start. Oh, we got to get um, power and stuff like that. I want to put these water things up here first. So all the water is flowing down here. And just kind of see what we've got going on there. So let's grab this guy. Oh, I want to put it right up there, though. Like, ideally, we'd put it up at the absolute highest point. Actually, let's try that one. And then we'll put that there. Oh, look at the waterfall. That's so cool. What? Hold on a second. Okay, so this is different. So I was thinking that when we played the alternate version, so like the alternate version of the beginning map, I thought we were gonna have the same tools. We don't. We have a fissure which means we have lava. What? This is super cool. Okay, this changes a lot of stuff. Um, This changes a lot of stuff. So what happens with, here, let's just, let's test. We gotta do some testing here. Let's test, um, if we do this, what happens when the water meets the lava? We blow that up, right? That's going to cause lava to flow down into that area. But then if we grab, say, this and this, is it going to just cause a rock right there? <gasps> oh, it does. So interesting. Very interesting. So do I want the lava to come in first or do I want the water? It depends on how many rocks we need. Because maybe we want this whole area to be lava or maybe we want it to be water. or Maybe we want it to be rocks. I don't actually know. Hmm. Okay, let's go ahead and do this. Let's pop this fissure open too. Maybe we'll keep the middle of it like a volcanic area. And then like the outsides will have like all the water going down into the lava area. That could be kind of cool. This is really neat. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and let's get some uh, power up on these guys. Because as far as I know, we still have the, the toxin scrubbers. We've still got this. Um, we've still got basically all the basic stuff except for like the fissures and stuff, which is really cool. Very, very interesting. All right, so let's go ahead. Let's get a... Because the water adds quite a bit of um, greenery. So it's giving us a little bit back. And it puts a rock right there. Interesting. I'm wondering if those rocks are going to become a problem, though. In the future. But let's go ahead and let's get some area cleared up here. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's start getting some greenery in here, shall we? We're uh, we're running a little low on the, on the funds here. <laughs> Let's see, that'll work there. That'll work there. Oh, there's just something so oddly satisfying about this game. Like, it's just so satisfying to do and to play. It's just like, it is such a good time. I'm actually kind of curious what, um, what terrain types we're going to need here. But you know what? It might still be the same as the, um, the original ones. It's just different. It's, I don't know. I don't, I just, I don't know. I'm excited. You know, we're actually not looking too, too shabby here. 
Uh, oh, you know what I just realized? Also with the rocks, that also gives us a new place to place down some power. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Oh, see, there's so many like different little mechanics in here that are like, it's so much fun. Okay, I think that's a good spot right there. We actually have a rock here, but it's too close. Can I place this here? Oh, I can, okay. And then let's go ahead and get these, uh, maybe some of this stuff filled in here. We're getting close, we're getting close, 84%. Let's see. Uh, we got this rock right here. We got this rock here, actually. Which means we could fill that area in. Another rock here, which means we could probably fill in Hmm. Maybe right there. This whole area right here might be a good, good little stretch. Actually, you know what? Let's do a right angle here. Let's do this. I'll go ahead and hit up another one. Maybe right in here. We've also got this stretch right here. Actually, I kind of forgot about that. We'll hit that. Okay, so now let's see what we got. Oh, it's still 99%. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Darn it. Uh, 17. There we go. Okay. And then let's see. Rain begins at greater than 70%. Okay, so we've got... So it must be the same three. So we have the forest, the wetland, and the fin bus. Okay. So it is. It's, it's pretty much the same. It's the same biomes. All right. So what we need to do here then... Is we probably need to get reduces the cost of some buildings and unlocks the ability to manipulate the region's climate. Oh, there we go. Let's get that. So let's see. We need to get uh, we need to get the humidity up. That is our probably first and foremost biggest thing that we need to do. So. We need to go ahead and get some wetlands in here. Hey, don't these have to be placed over? They do. Oh, none of them are next to water. Wait, what? Requires. None of these will work for providing. I guess they're all too far away from from water. Okay, so that's going to be interesting then. I also just realized I have no trees anywhere. So we can't place these. So we're going to have to start with We're going to have to start with getting um a forest down, I think. Yeah, I think we're going to start with getting a forest down. Oh, shoot. These can only target. This can only target the fin bus, though. Is there a tree anywhere? I think there's supposed to be a tree. I think there might be trees coming up in this area. I think that's what those things mean like that, but. Oh, this is interesting. So I'm going to place this. Hmm. I'm gonna place that there. And I'm going to place this here. And I'm going to see if I can turn that. Can I turn this one into a. Oh, I can't place it down because we don't meet the current humidity conditions. Okay. So now can I place them? No. This. No. So it must be humidity. No, because that's ideal conditions. Huh. What happens if you put a, a water thing directly on top of the lava? <laughs> that's what I want to know. All right, we're going to put some of these up, I guess. I don't feel like we should be putting those up yet. I feel like we should be placing down these. You know, this must have to be right next to water. That it's gotta be. Let's 
let's do this let's put this like that let's let it shoot its laser deal now let's let that water come in does that allow us to huh the water's right next to it though Place that there. I'm gonna re let's repump it up. Maybe, maybe, maybe it does. Maybe we have to wait for the humidity. That's so weird. I don't think I've ever ever had to wait for it. But you know what? Maybe we just naturally hit the the minimum humidity level that we needed to. I'm gonna blaze a line through right here to get the river flowing that way as well. So that give us a little bit more water to play with all right so there's that we're so close to the humidity that I'm just trying to I'm trying to see the problem is that once we place these down though we're not gonna be able to place any other ones any any closer because we're gonna have like these in the way so all right, I'm going to place another drill here so that way maybe we can add in a water thing right here. Yeah, that'll add uh, that water in. Beautiful. Okay. All right, so there we go. We got that done. Now, humidity or ideal conditions? What am I doing wrong here? It must, you know what? It's gotta be because it's not all on the same level of surface. That's what it is. It's so when it shows that that low ground, it has to be lower. It has to be down here. Interesting. Okay. So I need to make sure that I need to get water like down in here somehow. Hmm. What happens if we do this? And like we, what happens if we do this? Will it drill down and then drill down again? Oh yeah, it, it absolutely did. Okay, so now can I place one here? Okay. There we go, there we go. We got something. See now the problem is, now I need this humidity thing. I don't really have the ability to have one. Um, okay, so we need to somehow let's do this. We gotta get we gotta get power over here, and then we need this here. That'll detonate. That'll cause more rocks in this area to form. Very nice. And then what we can do from there is we can get this cleaned up. Something like this, and then get this, turn this into a, I forgot the best way to do this. We'll turn this into a wetland as well. And then can we do a cloud seeder on top of that? So that'll give us 9%. That's the biggest percentage that we've gotten so far. And we need to get, what, to 70 in order to get rain. We need more water on this lower level. Okay, so now I'm really regretting this lava here. <laughs> you know what? I think, I think this is the point. I think I'm going to go ahead and just restart. I think this is the first time I'm going to restart this region. Restart phase. Restart region. We're going to restart this. Yeah. Um, because I think the lava is not what you want. I think it's a hazard that we need to avoid at absolutely all costs. Now, I think we're going to have to utilize it for some things. Oh, and now everything's different. I think we're going to have to utilize it for some things, but I think we want to get the water in first. Um, I think that's what we're going to try. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to try to get the, the water in first and see what's going to happen there. Yeah, see if we can just get all the water flow in here first, I think that's gonna help us out a lot. 
All right, see, I mean, just look at that already. That that amount of water already looks so much better. Oh, it almost made it. Then we can just hit this one up here. Call this good. Yeah, that looks so much better. I think I think that was the I think that was the appropriate choice to do at that time. Okay, so we've got water flowing everywhere except for like right in here, which I mean, I guess we could. Yeah, I'll go ahead and hit that there. Not really worried about that part right there. Perfect. Okay, so we've got that. Now we need to go ahead and we need to get, get everything greened up here. So let's get through the green phase and see how this goes. So this area right in here is what's going to need to be our wetland. So what we need to be able to do is we need to be able to place these down in here. But we need power. We have no power down in here yet. So that's where these fissures are going to come in handy is we got to figure out how to blow this up and cause it to just give us enough area. What if we just hit it with one of these? Wait a second. This is different than the one we had before. The one we had before was tiny. It was the little one. That's interesting. I wonder why that changed. <laughs> Maybe it was supposed to be this one the whole time. Okay, yeah, we're going to have to use these. Um, I'm not sure how this is going to work, though. Because like, I want to hit this, but I want it to turn. I need more stone than anything. You know what I'm saying? Um, let's hit that one there. Let's just kind of see what happens with this. Okay, so that's going to leak. We got two things. Okay. So we have enough room for that. And then let's go ahead and get this in here. And then we'll go ahead and do this. And we'll do another one right here. And then that will allow us to hopefully put those into um, wetlands. And then we need to do the same thing over here. But what we need to do is we need to get water closer to this guy first, I think. And then we need to do um, some kind of explosion right here. The only problem is there's not really a lot of land right here. Uh, we'll just put it right there and hope for the best. Let's see what happens. Okay, so it places it on each side. That works out for us. So we'll do one there. Basically, all of this land here needs to turn into wetlands. So we've got this one. We got this one. We need. We need. We need something in here. We've got to get something. Got to get something close to that. So this one's pretty close. That might be the closest option we get to it. Let's go ahead and do that. That'll get us water to like right here. And then if we blow this up right here. Like that, that'll give us a little bit more. We'll see what happens here. We got one rock. Uh, Not super ideal. Oh, we are getting really, wait, do we only have 26 left? Hold on. Oh, we have 316. Okay, the, the thing was over it. I couldn't see it. All right, no, we're good. We're good. We're good. Okay. I was like, oh my gosh.
Okay, that looks good. So we focused on the wetlands area. I think we'll get enough wetlands out of that. I think I think it's gonna be fine. So let's go ahead and let's just focus on the biggest area now that we can go ahead and transform probably this area here. All right, we're getting close. We're at 93. All right, we got the 100%. Fantastic. So now we have our other things. Okay, so let's see if we can actually make our wetlands possible right now. I want to make sure that we can do that. There's 56, 54, 37, 35. Oh, are we getting, are you kidding me? <laughs> I thought we were good. Okay. We got to put something here. Apparently, um, if we want to hit that wetlands, we've got to place something right here. And then we also need to get the humidity up. I wonder if actually. Do we have the ability to get the humidity up? That would get us to 17% right there. All right, let's put that one in. What about this one? That'll get us another. Oh, that'll get us 71? That's thunderstorms, baby. Yes. Yes. Okay, that's rain. That is good. That will that will fill in our map. That'll get us a whole bunch of stuff. Okay, that was that was magnificent. <laughs> So we need to place, we do need more wetlands though. So what we need to do is we need to pop this open because I need the rock um, in order to place anything down. Cause I need, uh, I need the a windmill over here. So I need like that guy there, that there. We got to place something here, though. I guess I can place that anywhere, huh? Yes, yeah, so we'll do that. And then let's go ahead and turn this. 26. Okay. We did it. We hit our wetlands. Now we've got to get the forest. The problem with that is I don't actually know how to get a tree. I don't have an igniter. the water sign to lower the ambient humidity i don't know why i would want that unless i can burn that it's the only thing i can think of is that, that i could burn that because i don't have any trees anywhere i don't have any trees anywhere i can't ignite anything because it requires a finbos which this creates Unless I'm missing a tree somewhere. It's like one tree in the game. Maybe not. I think we're going to have to try the dehumidifier and seeing if we can light that. Maybe the dehumidifier can light the... Um... That's the only thing I can think of. Is that maybe this... If I do that, that would cause that. And then maybe I could put this in. Uh-oh. I can't even place this in here anywhere. Now, can I select? Aha! It is. Okay, so you have to use the dried grass in order to do the burn. That might actually be enough forest for us. It's not going to be enough uh, finbos for us, though. We'll go ahead and burn this one, too. It's going to burn all the way to here. That'll be fine. I'd like to get right up here if I could. Oh, I can. Okay, let's do that. Select this area. That'll burn all that up. And then we should be able to go ahead and place this in there. Should be able to get all these in here. And then from there, we need to get this. So what we actually need now, what I actually need now is I need a lot of rain. We 
We need rain to come in and uh, rewater this. You know, I don't know if that's going to be enough. We honestly might have to have some more. Oh, we're not going to get rain because we're at 64% humidity now. We might need to dry out this area right here. Minus 10%. Oh my gosh, that's terrible. All right, let's do that. Let's get this in here and then let's go ahead and select this top area first. And then we'll select this area. And then that should work. That should be plenty. That'll burn to there and basically just this area right here. Okay, so we'll try to get that into another Finbus area. Um, I want the rain to come back. And then we can turn these all into the arbor areas, which is just fine. Oh, the tree, the actually, it, looks, it sounds like the rain's coming back. Oh, I mean, rain begins. Maybe it's, maybe it doesn't matter if you lower it back down, it still rains. Let the rain come in. Let it, let all this turn back to green and then we'll get, um, we'll get these placed. Perfect. I mean, I guess we can go ahead and uh, increase uh, our humidity again by placing that right there. That'll take us to 79. We got to get to 90% then we get the salmon run, which I honestly don't think that's going to be an issue at all. There's 91%. Look at that. Done. Salmon run. Ta -da! Okay. So let's see. That is still filling in, but that's going to give us 44 right there. This is going to give us 58. I'm waiting for the rain to stop so that way these like random little one-off tiles maybe will get filled in. All right, the rain stopped. Let's just go ahead and get these going. So there's 56. I did a good section. There's 59. All right, so we're, we're, we're about halfway. There's 36. There's a little bit more. <laughs> Negative nine. Uh, let's see. What, can, what else can we do here? So 28. So there'll be seven. A little bit more. Oh, we're going to have to do a little bit more. Yeah. Oh, wait. Hold on. No, there we go. Okay. We're good. All right. So now we need to recycle and find animals. That's That's not too bad. That's not so bad at all. Oh. Oh, we got the flying recycling drone. Oh, that's nice. Okay, so we got to place this guy down first. Place that down. Place that down. Make it fly. Now. Okay. We do have the rock hopper too. Oh, we got to place this guy down. All right, so let's go ahead and let's look for our animals. So deer... Let's go and put that there. The froggies. They want uh, finbos and water. Oh. Uh, oh, right there maybe. We weren't sure. We never really found those guys, did we? All right, so let's find the beaver. Um, ooh, water and forest. Ooh, I don't know if that's considered water. Not enough. What about maybe right there? Or right here? Not enough. Not just, just not enough water yet. Or right there. Not enough forest. We are just barely not having enough water for these, uh, these poor little beavers. You know what? Here. <laughs> we need more water. Guess what? Give them more water. blow that up that'll give more water look at that now we have a pond plenty of water now right yeah look at that beavers are happy we give them their own little pond over there all right so we got three of three oh, okay so the bears so we've got in range of at least 24 styles 
on a hill. Oh, we're done. That was it. And they're in right. Wow, we got that first try. All right, what do you guys want? I have no idea. Um, partially in a lake. Oh. Well, do they want a whole lake? Hey. All right, and then these guys probably want to be in range of deer, but probably higher up. Uh, forest and deer. Okay, so here's forest. So let's go ahead and let's get some deer, maybe. We get some deer in here. Hmm. We need the deer. We need the forest right next to a uh, an open plainsy area. We don't really have that anywhere, do we? What about right here? Will the deer go there? No. Okay, so what we need to do... We need to burn up something again. But just a small... It just needs to be a, like a small... Like this little section right here would be perfect, you know? Burn that up. Actually, you know what? Can we... Has to be on a rock, doesn't it? And that's our finmost. We can't get rid of our finmost. We need that. Don't want that. Ooh, this little section right here might be perfect. Let's do that. We'll turn this into... Yeah, we'll turn... My water pump just is not going to work now. <laughs> it's just... It's just, it just noped right out. Okay, so we'll do this. There goes the water again. And then we'll go ahead and burn this. That'll burn. That'll burn everything over here. But that'll be okay. So there's that, and then we'll go ahead and put an arbor thing in once this is done. And then we should be able to go ahead and place some deer over here. And then we should be able to place this guy right here. Nailed it. All of them done. We've got all the animals. It is time for some recycling. We're not at 100% humidity though. Should we be at 100% humidity? I feel like we probably should. Um, there's that one and hold on. Let's, let's hit another. Let's get the, let's hit the hundo. Um, you know what? There's one. There's 100% humidity, baby. We did it. We done it. Okay. It's cleanup time now. So now what we have, we have the flying drone. It was right there. <laughs> oh, he's flying. Okay. Now if I place this down. Does the flying drone pick up these, or is it only going to be the monorails? Can I mark this? Okay, so now can I place... So if I place that there, and I place this here, it'll pick up that, right? Let's just check this out. Let's make sure that this is this is A-OK, -okay and this is indeed what we're doing here. And slurp, and slurp. Perfect. Okay. This works. So, actually, all we really need to do is we need to put these... Um, well, actually, I need to put these down, and then that will suck the... Does that take down the wind turbines, too? Because I actually... Yeah, okay, perfect. Because I need those rocks in order to be able to pick them up. Okay. Sounds good. I'm going to go ahead and place a bunch of these down, get these all cleaned up, and then... Uh, yeah, we'll see We'll see what I'm missing when I <laughs> once I get closer. Uh, I'm not going to lie. It was actually a little tricky down in here because there wasn't a whole lot of places I could place these. Uh... Let's see, I think we're good. I think we got everything we need. So we'll go ahead and start placing these things down. And then we'll go ahead and start um, making those, uh, setting them up so they can be gathered. I'm hoping that there's going to be enough range on all of these. So let's find out here. So like this one's obviously good. That one's no problemo. That one's good. Okay, the range on this thing, the range on this collection thing is actually really good. Ooh, it's not going to collect that one, though. All right, we'll see how this goes. So we'll let it collect everything. We'll see what's left. See if it grabs this one. No, it won't. Okay, that's the one I was worried. Oh, I forgot about that one. <laughs> 
Okay, do we have any other pieces laying anywhere? No. All right, so we've got these. Basically just got these right here. Now, how can I... <laughs> Uh, you know what? We're gonna need a rock hopper. Um, this one I can get. This one, I cannot. Okay, let's place that there. Alright, so we just hopped a rock. Should be able to place that there, and then should be able to clean these up. Nailed it! Is that everything? I think that's it. I think we did it. We did the quarry! The quarry has been completed. My gosh. I gotta say, this one is really cool. That was really fun. Uh, it was it was different. It was fun. And I was, it was exciting, you know, uh, trying to figure it out. And I, you know what? The failure was fun. I enjoyed it. I was like, you know what? This isn't going to work. Now I know what I'm doing. That was cool. That was so much fun. We always got to take screenshots. But that is going to end this episode. Hopefully you enjoyed If you did, make sure you leave a like if you're new here. Don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. Do really appreciate the support. And we'll, like I said, we'll be back with a whole bunch more Terranil because I'm loving this game. It seems like everybody else is enjoying it as well. So um, look at that. Wasteland Reclaimed. So we got to get out to the main menu. We've got to see what our percentile is because, I mean, we 100%ed that one, right? So let's go ahead and let's see... Um, I wonder if there's like an island specific percentile. So that one we didn't 100% the first time though. Oh, it says we 100%ed it. I mean, we did all that. We did all that. Because the river valley, we did not finish it the first time. So I guess you just have to 100% it one time and then just finish it another time. Oh, that's so cool. So um, yeah, next episode we're going to do Arc archipelago archipelago i know archipelago i don't know how to say that i'm sorry <laughs> i bet you the comments are telling me but that's gonna end it thank you so much for coming out have a wonderful day i'll see you in the next one bye everybody